y'all so today i'll be doing my final thoughts on this hair right here this hair i um did a first when well, i necessarily the first impressions a uh, initial review on this hair and this hair is from lobby hair and i put it right here in the um, vi in the in the video but i did an initial review and today i'll be doing my final review now i've had this hair for quite a while probably two months if not more than that probably two three months but i've had this hair for a very very long time and i'm finding I'm finally getting to the final review. Now, the first time I did the initial review, I told you that it was thin. It was a little bit thin, but I do like how soft it is. It's very, very soft. It's very easy to curl. It's just really, really nice hair. But I do have a problem with the ends looking thin. Now, the first time I had it in, I don't know why I'm so out of breath. <laughs> now, the first time I had it in, I had it um, sewn in. And I took the sew-in out, and then I made it into a wig. And this is the wig that I'm wearing. And, um... But the first time I did the sew in, I did the closure and I did two bundles and um, I didn't end up using all of the third bundle. But this time when I made it into a wig, I took it out so I can make it into a wig. That way I can try to fit all of the hair in thinking maybe that will make it look a, bit, a little bit thicker. Now it does look thicker at the, um, at the top parts, but when you get to the end, it's very, very thin. So I think that's mostly from the, um, the longest bundle. I have 18 inch, 16, 14, and a 12 inch closure. So I think that the um, the longest bundle is what's causing the thinness. And I have all the hair up to the front, by the way. And this is how the ends look. It's very, very thin. I really don't like that about it because I like for my hair to be really, really full from roots all the way down. Maybe I should have got a longer, um, longer length. I don't know, but I just really don't like how thin it is. I never really had this problem with any of my other hair. But it does look a little bit thin at the ends. But other than that, it's very easy to curl. It's really, really nice and soft. I haven't had any problems with shedding, not like excessive shedding, probably like the normal shedding when I brush it. But um, I didn't seal the wefts when I put it, when I make this wig, I didn't seal the wefts. I did cut a few of the wefts when I did my sew in, so when I made my wig, I had a, uh, a couple of the wefts that were cut, but um, I didn't really cut too many because I don't really like cutting my wefts. But um, I made it onto, um, like I told you, I made it onto a wig and I used the dome mesh cap. And that cap is actually a little bit small. I probably would go back to my normal dome cap because the mesh one seems to be a little bit tight on my head because my head is kind of big. <laughs> but um, uh, otherwise, I like how the hair feels. I just really don't like how thin the ends are. See? It's like really, really thin. <laughs> but like I said, as far as the softness, it's very soft. It's very bouncy. And I just really like how it curls. It's really, really nice hair other than the fact that the ends are really nice and thin. So if I was to purchase this hair, I would probably get the shorter lengths. If I was gonna do like a bob or something, I probably wouldn't really go too long. I, I probably wouldn't go too long for the fear of having really thin ends. Maybe it's just a bundle that I had, but I just, I didn't understand how my ends were so thin, even though I did use all three bundles and the closure. But um, that's pretty much, those are my thoughts on this hair. I really like it. I've been wearing it like crazy. I really, really like it. Other than the fact that the ends are really, like, really, really thin. So if you have any comments or any questions or anything, leave them down below. And I will also have everything linked down below the website if you want to check it out. I have everything linked down in the description box. So thank y'all so much for watching and I'll see y'all in my next one. Bye.